I'm talking, of course, about extremism and extremist ideology. Look at this, man. It's an ozone bite. Someone put it out here in this crap, dog. Ooh, this is a nasty one. Here. Is that the new bike box? LED. Then we got a Huffy Stonehaven. Okay. Stuffy, stuffy Huffy. It's the Huffy that's stuffy in the Stonehaven. Check it out, y'all. It's got the camera thing in it. Actually, I don't think this is really like a camera. This is a, I think it monitors the trash level. So it's like a, a smart dumpster or whatever. And when it gets to a certain level, then they know to come pick it up. Instead of just having a route come every, you know, Monday, every Wednesday, every Friday, just have it come whenever it's full. But anyways, I seen this picture poking out over here and I was like, wow, that looks really pretty because it's like legit. It's presented by Uline, Matthew Crowley. That's a real pretty picture though. Canoeing in the North Woods. I'll be there one day, soon enough. That's real nice. And it has an autograph too, Matthew Crowley. I wonder if that's worth anything. At the fabric. So tear at the fabric of who we are as an institution. Hello! What's going on in here? Hi! Hey, look at that. There's some good juicy wire. Grab those. Little ticket dispenser for when you're in the parking garage. The Lord busted all arms. Coming on me, man. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dirty hole. Been going on down under here. There's a panel or something. But uh, doesn't look like much else. I see somebody's shoe. Way back over yonder. Got it. I seen some scrappity doos uh, sticking up at the top of this here. Uh, hey, look at that. There's Christmas gifts up here too. But some metal. Looks like uh, legs to a table, perhaps. Oh, uh, come here. Got a little weight, man. That's some that's some quality architecture, man. Yeah, that's some heavy duty legs. Sexy legs. I like them big and uh big and beefy, you know. Big old drumstick dipping some blue cheese. Oh yeah. Just dip it like a big old Big old juicy meaty thing. Mm. I'm juicy, I'm meaty. There's a box. Uh oh, it's heavy. It's got something in it. No way, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. No, uh I can't tell just quite yet if this thing has been opened or not. Oh, here we go. Oh my, it does look brand new in there. We'll see what's up. Here, we'll put the, the thing back on it. I'm wondering if we're gonna take a definite closer look at this bad boy. But I'm uh, wondering if maybe it's a, uh, a a damaged 
TV or something because it looks like it may have kind of been opened. Either way, I'll take it. See, I take them all damaged and those with their sanity. I'm in need of some help because I'm crazy and stuff. It's under this rug, y'all. What the crap is that? Ow. It looks like a, uh, a mount for a, a monitor or a TV. Put your keyboard or something right here. I guess it mounts onto a table because it's got these clamps. Well, there's another first for the old scavenger, sort of. This one is nastiness. More nastiness. Alrighty, bro, what have we got up in here? Look like a little compressor. Oh, two compressors. Not bad. We have here that's the California air tools, those are nice. They uh, they can be like the uh, super duper uber quiet. And you know what's funny? I was just man, I have this pancake compressor in my garage that uh got from my grandpa's house that the air regulator busted off of, and I was gonna kind of kind of wait to see, but I don't know, those look a little bit nicer than that compressor I don't know it's a piece of a a bun coffee thing that's probably stainless right there and then these heating coils those are stainless breaking those compressors are a fine though I tell you I wonder what's wrong with them well, we're just gonna have to plug them in and find out, huh? This one's still holding air. Little lift, lift, lift in the truck. Ooh. I got these bolts right here. Take bolts right there. Here's a gold burnt up bolts right here. Got some toasty parts. No lie. They're toasty. Oh. Oh. Ooh. What do we have here? Premium hemp isolate. CBD dog. For getting your healthiness on. Ugh. No, man, I'm good on CBD. I just, uh, I think it's crack. What is this garbage here? I think I see a light. There goes a light, making me feel bright. It's totally out of sight. Ballast, all right. Big, big bad boy out of here. That's an old 96er, man. 96 inches. It's down there. Really far down there. Must have gone all the way down to China or something. The endless bottomless dumpster. What's up, safety specs? Uh, here. Set that down yonder. And then these, these LED lights, that's aluminum breakage. All that right there. 
They have a nice piece of aluminum on the back. You can get down with it. Look at all those ballasts. And a big old breaker. It's really hard. What are these? These are different. Constant current. Oh, it's an LED driver for uh, driving them LEDs. What's that? I don't know, man. But it is definitely scrap worthy with our LED drivers. A whole mess of them in here. What other kind of BS up in here? There goes a little bit. It's an interesting looking light. It says it's good. Take that at face value, huh? Aluminum. Ooh, what is this? Down on this end, boy. It's a motor starter. Golly, and there's a bunch of ballast down here too. Now that it looks like we're kind of getting down into some stuff, I pulled the truck a little bit closer because this is looking absolutely fantastic. Like this right here. Can't beat that. Big pieces. It's crap in here. More crap in the dudes. A little bit more. Little bit of some stuff here. Right there. Ah, got a air spray nozzle here. Nice piece of wire there. A lot of ballast. There's a I hear a frog. I must be creeping on his territory or something. It's a big old breakers. Big fat daddy. Daddy of the Mac, daddy. There's a light bulb. It's getting a little grody. All right, I hear you. I get out of here. Sorry. I didn't mean to bother you in your time of frogness. Got us a crapper here, man. That's the, uh, that's a really nice fancy one. Y'all remember that movie, uh, Stay Tuned, The Napper Crapper 5000? <laughs> Spinning that wheel, baby. Man, this thing flew into my truck and it scared me. You, hey! Get out of there. Ooh. Ooh. Flew right into the truck. Scared me. Almost wrecked. Almost wrecked it, dog. <gasps> Look at that, there goes some lights. And what do we have here? Uh, looks like a box of uh, office supplies. <laughs> some paper. Look, there's another ballast. Some new crap in here. Anything fun? Art tape. There's some printer roll crap. Oh, it's a piece of a chair. Cool. There's a bunch of uh, 
Well, envelopes and the big printer is what that goes with that tape out there, I bet. What else we got in here? Hey, look at that. There's an AT&T Plantronics Explorer 243. Just set these nice. Be a little careful or in to put things in the truck. I got some breakables back there for show. Envelopes anyway. Hey, look at that bucket of nastiness, man. But there's a uh, disintegrated rim under there. Kind of looks like uh, a woman, maybe. Oh, man. Oh, true story. This is what they put on their chili dog at the carnival. <sighs> Comes right from there. Yeah, no, that's not an alloy wheel. I don't think, I think it's a steel. It is a steel. It's a steel. Nice and heavy too. Looks like it came off a Ford. Stock Ford. What you got in your box? Ooh, it's another box. Just a box in a box. Oh my gosh. Have you ever seen such a thing? What is this thing? It's a, it's a way car. I think that's an air purifier. It's got a plug. Rock and roll. Do a little curb side in here, finish her up, huh? Mr. True Tip of Werber. All rusted out. The Werber and the Werber. Whoa, look at that. It's an Aberth. That's pretty cool. Some kids gonna like to have that. But we'll leave the kitty stuff for the kitties and the boy stuff for the boys. Speaking of boys, this one's for the boys. It says it's a bull. Wow, that's a good looking cooler. <sighs> Uh, a little stainless on there. Not much. Look like something pretty interesting back here. Is that for the front porch? Oh my gosh, was there a candle in there and it melted? A black candle. That's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool thing though. Gotta get that candle out of there. I think I seen something back here. Ooh, look at that. The eight foot garden arch. Take that. But I thought I saw something hanging out back there. Is that for cooking your wieners? Oh, it's just a uh, 
a Samsung sub cabinet. I thought it was a pooter. It's all right, though. For the bananas. Hey, there's a clock. Cool. It's a cool bottle. There's a uh, nativity scene. What is this? It's made in Taiwan. It's a skewer set. That's a piece of glass. Okay. Ooh. The crap is this? It's like a big stainless uh, piece of a tabletop. Yeah, for like a uh, a kitchen. That's stainless. Look at that guy. It's torched. <laughs> Got you a hole in there. Wow, well, coming up on that hole, man. <sighs> Broken dish. How'd I guess? Looks like we got some stuff over here. Look at that, two pieces of a Bowflex. Oh, and then there's the uh, the bottom part. Slip it in there. Oh my gosh, look at the wheels. Need some new wheels. Yeah, like that. And I also got the fuzz. This is the uh, the the tread climber, I think, is what they call it. Oh, watch your head. Tank. Tank that. And I'll take that. All righty, guys. I think uh, I think this is gonna top us off right here, huh? Nice washer and a dryer, Maytag. We'll get the uh, get the washer up here first. Yeah, the washer. That's the heavy one, and then the dryer is the lighter one. Put this bad boy right up here. How you do it? Right there. Whoa, look at that halo car. Anyways, I was driving by, I had this keen sense of uh, scrap sensations in places sometimes and, and uh, I saw these hands and um, those sensations came true those must be the lids and uh, here we are sensationalizing digging in the trash <sighs> pots Gosh, guys, we're climbing up really high today. That was an awesome scavenging adventure out there for sure. Started it off into some dumpsters, got up this morning and I was like, you know what? Let me put in a little extra OT for my uh, my favorite peeps and uh, look what we got. Totally maxed out, totally maxed out. Definitely gonna have to do a small little follow up because there's a, uh, a little TV monitor thing in there still in the box. Hopefully we didn't crush it up. I don't think so. I think I got it pretty well, you know, packed in there good. 
and a couple other tchotchke nits to kind of just look at and see. So yeah, we'll do a quick little follow up for you guys. Uh, I'm gonna get on to the scrapyard, get this crap unloaded. Uh, got some rain coming in so I get all this electronic stuff out. So see y'all then, love y'all, bye. What we got here y'all? Scrappy, scrappy, scrappy. Ah!